So let's talk about how you make a decision as to whether or not you double cut. Come in close. This is Thai boot leather. And of course, it's among the finer of the cuts of leather. And so I'm going to put two factory edges close together, which are about 22 inches long. Okay. And I'm going to show you what I do. Just keep the camera there. And I'm going to show them what I do when I join that seam. So I'm simulating the seam according to the factory edge. What do you think so far? This is only 20 inches. If I should do three feet, this line will become down here. What happens is, you can see that the leather is not imperfectly cut. It's the way the leather is filling out on the wall. If you don't double cut your leather, you're going to have a very imperfect edge. That's the best you're gonna get if you, if you butt the edges. Okay, that's the cut. Let's take them over here. I'll show you the same wallpaper with a double cut. I gotta be honest, I don't know where the, uh, the line is. I don't know where my double cut is. Here it is. This is my double cut. You do not see any light. If you can see the scene through your camera, it's simply because there is an interruption between the two pieces of leather. And it's because there's a seam there. For example, if you have a leather jacket, right? It's all the same material. Where the shoulder starts, you're gonna see the, the interruption. Same thing here. This is what you want. Let's go back over here. And this is what you don't want. Now look at that line. Bring them in close, zoom in, please. No matter how much you try to do this, you're always gonna have this. Please, double cut your leather. So let's do it. Let's do a double cut. Let's double cut this stuff. I'm overlapping it two and a quarter inches. Pushing all the air out of it, and now we'll come down with a double cut. Let's get a new blade on this thing. You tell me, would you ever do a butt joint again? Let me cover it. Tell me where the seam is. You get the point. The point is, you gotta double cut. If you don't know how to do it, take your time. You'll learn. You'll learn how to do it. And when you get the right tool, the thinnest black metal blades, and you have a steady hand, 
you can't beat it and you'll never go back to doing butt joints again when you don't have to. If you have any questions, if you like the video, please click that on like, hit that subscribe button, and I'll see you on the next one.